Mount Rushmore of animal traits you would like to have. Wait, wait. It's animal traits that you wish that you had. Animal qualities animal that you wish you had. Yeah. I prepared for the wrong Mount Rushmore. What did so you let's do? go. Like my first one's the ability to fly. Okay. Uh, so well, which what animal? animal? Bald eagle. Okay, okay, you just picked a bald eagle. Animal qualities that you wish. Yeah, you, you don't want there. the fastest. You want no, the Pelagrine Falcon, dude, bro. Dude, oh, dude, sorry, I'm sorry, sorry. I'm gonna go with <laughs> tiger stripes. What? I just <laughs> tigers have badass stripes. I'll go with the cheetah's speed. <laughs> you just wish you were fast. Yeah, That's I wish I was a cheetah. A cheetah's speed. Okay. No, the speed of a cheetah. Like the mess. This is of the a worst cheetah. Mount Rushmore we've ever done. <laughs> to cocoon up and then become a butterfly. Oh. <laughs> you just, wait, I don't wait, know if wait. that would be cool. So Hank, you wanna you want the ability to start out as a shitty gross thing and then become marginally more attractive. Yeah. I mean it's better than my current situation, which is just like a shitty gross thing <laughs> no. for a life. A whale's jizz. <laughs> I wish that when I jizz, it just makes a, such a big mess. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing can clean it up. I wish uh, my last one, I'll go with a bear's fishing ability. That would be sick. If I could just fucking grab fish out of the water, that would be pretty fun. Mm -hmm. Anything? No? Okay. Rocky did that. You guys are doing nothing here. I'm just thinking about you doing that. It would be wait, sick. Wait. You would never do it, though. Yes, I would. I would be like, hey, guys, watch me grab this fish out of the fucking river. You know what would be crazy? I think you could do that, though. No Still. way. What? Yes. You think I could just grab salmon by the fucking thousand? Yes. No chance. I, dude, I've been watching a lot of Planet Earth. Like, their method is not that crazy. It's. It would be awesome you to just, be just go, grab Their it. method is they go out in freezing water and they stand there for hours and, and they catch it with their mouths. Right. And they just scoop them I, up. You but you catch could it with do your that mouth. in theory. Yeah, I could do not that Not with too. your mouth. He can't catch it with his mouth. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. You could. You cannot catch a fish with your hand in a river, Hank. <laughs> yes, there I is could. no chance. Yes, I could. Okay, well, we'll yes, have I to could. find a way to prove that there's no chance you could do it. Give me enough time in a fucking you know, Alaska. enough time? Dude, in Alaska, when the fish are, like, coming downstream, there, there's a million of them. You they go, up, they go upstream. They go upstream. the salmon. Second Whatever. of all, you can't even get Larry in a net. <laughs> in a tank. A goldfish. Facts. Facts. The Mount Rushmore of athletes you would like to storm, have on your side storming Area 51. They have to be alive, and it can be old athletes, current athletes, whatever. I'll just take Dennis Robin because he knows he's he went to North Korea. He can figure out you know diplomatic stuff. Kevin Garnett. Okay. okay. Pull up with the Uzi, M16s, a couple joints, all of them, silencers. Okay. okay. My second one, I guess I'll go with Sam Cassell. Very that's, good call. Yeah, I said that on the last show. Yeah. But, but good but job, okay. Hank. I know, I like pick. that. Yeah. yeah. Use you what should you have picked it. Uh, my second. You're the first person to say Sam Cassell looks like an alien? Yes. I was, PFT was. I, and he knows of. I'll go with James Harrison. He just shows up with his gray sweatsuit, and you know it's on. My last one's going to be Marshawn. Mm, Marshawn okay. Lynch, tough to bring down in any situation. Uh, Facts. Would probably just smoke the aliens out, make them real chill. Let's throw mm -hmm. out what mm -hmm. we recently saw on the beach. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> come on. But Coach O, because there will be a moment where things will get down and be like, I don't know if we can do this. And we'll all look to Coach O and he'll get us back up. Yeah. He so will. he'll get us ready to go. Today we're talking Mount Rushmore of uh, meats, BBQ eats, favorite food items, throw on the charcoal grill. Okay. My PFT. first one. This is easy. Wings. Buffalo wings. Whoa. Okay. I will go with bacon. Whoa. Okay. It's a basic I didn't see that pick. one going. It's all a right. Very basic pick. You didn't see what? You're the one of the epic is... bacon sriracha guys. That's fine. Yeah. I just didn't think it. Steak and sausage. Okay. Those are my two two picks. And number two, I will go with Kobe beef. Oh, okay. I had this. I went to Isn't a... Isn't that just uh, steak? Also, Kobe go. beef problematic. problematic. Very problematic. problematic beef. <laughs> yeah. You guys are haters. Whoa. Oh, okay. Bacon and Kobe beef. Is yeah. Like, Hank, well, I, I mean, I'm just predicting uh, you're going to get buried. You done, Hank? <laughs> are you done criticizing my answers? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Not at all. Then no. A fish that you caught with your bare hands. Yes. Because they, well, I, they always taste better if you grab them yourself out of the river when they're swimming downstream. I'll go with human liver with some fava beans and a nice candy. I ate his liver with some fava beans and a nice candy. I will go uh, with the meetup for tickets before the big game. Oh, the meet up, oh, the meet up. Okay. There Little Hezzy Hay. Hezzy Hay. There we go. Was a great Mount Rushmore. That guys. one was contentious. We missed a couple, though. Do you guys like spam? Nope. 
Spam and fried spam is delicious. <laughs> nope. <laughs> fried chicken. We could have done fried mm-hmm. spam. Is so on brand. It's, I love to I love to fry my chicken then just throw it on the grill. What does that mean, <laughs> Hank? Spam is on brand. It's for just me. right up there with like the the a hundred thousand boxes of cornflakes. <laughs> spam is bad. No, it's not. Yeah, I'm pretty confident saying spam is bad. Not at it's all. It's okay. That's it's, a hill I'll die it's on. It's contentious to Mount Rushmore's. <laughs> we good? We want to hug it out, bitch? Mount Rushmore of juniors. Ken Griffey Jr. Number one. Okay. Good, good choice. Good pick. Good basic Hank. choice. The bacon of juniors. Uh, I'll go with uh, Junior Soprano, number two. Fuck. That's how but I, is that's he I like? Too. What are he, his, you? About his name to is say? Junior Soprano. Hank, what are you about to say? Ju- we don't get contentious anymore. No. But no PFT. Let him go. What are you about to fucking say? Choose you your piece words of shit. wisely, Hank. But we don't get contentious. He didn't even eat pussy. <laughs> that's that's, that's true. very true. That's and true. And he shot Tony. No, he did eat pussy. Oh, true. He oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He, he was a pussy king. Yeah. Martin Luther King Jr. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Pander much? No, I, I think that's uh, just a solid, solid pick. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It'd be a shame if racists didn't vote for my Mount Rushmore. Do you guys like Junior Mints? Yeah. Mm, I, like I had that Mints. on my that's list, my too. Pick. Yeah. Yeah, I love Junior Mints. Also, Junior Mints feels like the you can't... The one thing I like about Junior Mints, I don't think you can get it everywhere. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's mostly like a movie theater. Yeah, or it's, it's a vending machine snack. Right, is what it exactly. Is. It's not. I like that about it. Uh, Hank my, is Hank is looking at me. He's giving he's me staring eyes. daggers. You, you're giving me eyes. You're giving you look you look like Junior Soprano, and I'm a big pussy. I'm gonna go with Junior the movie with okay. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yep, where he gets pregnant and has I, a kid. I thought of that, but uh, then I realized that we're fucking old. But so, I mean, yeah. it translates to anybody. Yeah. It's Arnold it's Schwarzenegger. And he's pregnant. Yeah, I, I Dude, literally had Arnold Schwarzenegger. I haven't seen that many Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> I, I literally movies. thought of it because I I obviously remember it as a kid, and then I put my brain in Hank's head, and I was like, he's gonna be like, what? Wait, so you're pandering to no, a younger audience? No, 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 no. Admitted pandering. I just yes, know yes, half our audience that's doesn't have it. Oh yeah, so you're so you're pandering no, to the audience. No, I'm trying then. to be relatable to our audience. Oh well, that's There's a big difference. That's oh, very pandering. Big There's difference. a big difference. Very pandering. The junior movie still stands. Schwarzenegger's okay. no, pregnant. No, it stands. I like Great it as a flick. pick. Great I like flick. it as a pick. You should have put on your Mount Rushmore. A lot of people don't know. My next one is Coach O. Ed Ogeron. Petit Bebe. Mm-hmm. He is a junior. Are you sure he's a full, officially a junior? Yes, he's a junior. Okay. Did you check it? Yes, Ed Ogeron Jr. Did you double check it? Yes. Okay. Did you triple check it? No. Okay. Pandering, because was everyone's, everyone said my Coach O pick last, on Wednesday was awesome. Uh, all right. My last <laughs> one is... You you want to think I'm pandering? I'm this is the anti anti pander pick, Bronny James Jr. I'm gonna squat on that one. I'm gonna buy that stock. What do you think about that, Hank? Uh, I think Mount Rushmore is a mountain that was built after great people. <laughs> he so is great, dude. Have put, you seen his highlight uh, tape? Uh, like sixteen year old on a mountain <laughs> that's about his, people have that you are accomplished. Seen his highlight tape? You are forgetting that this is all about a mountain of greatness. <laughs> oh, I know this is Not an anti LeBron James podcast. Future greatness. I still went with Bronny James Jr. Plus, he's gonna be a bust. Oh, wow. Damn. Well, he's already an alcoholic. 